Also, you may have received a notification from Facebook about your business page and it looks something like this. It needs your review. If we don't hear from you, the information in question will be, oh, what will it be? So I'm just going to open it in a new tab and we will see what happens. So it's loading the page. Okay, and it's telling me that it's going to change the suggested price range from nothing to two pound symbols. So I can either reject or accept it. But actually, I, I don't want to reject it. I want to make a different suggestion. So I kind of have to accept or reject that before I can find the other section. So we're going to have a challenge trying to find this in the settings. Uh, so let's have a go. Yeah, so I've just rejected it and it's gone away. Oh dear, are we ever going to find it again? So let's have a look. Page info. What have we got here? Description, phone number, website, location, located, parking, hours. Ah, here we go. Here is the price range section. So for Business Buzz Networking, it's a very low price. It's only £5, which includes your tea and coffee in the Beach House St Albans every month the third Thursday of the month. So I'm going to select that. If you had a business who, which was very high end, very pricey, you would want this one because you wouldn't want the type of customers and inquiries for, oh dear, your business to uh, have these people that want very, very low costs. So you'd put it there. If you do provide bargain costs, then you'd want it lower. So this can be useful to get away the people that aren't actually your qualified buyers because they don't have a big enough budget to be your customers. Or uh, if you have a mid-range product, if you don't want to put people off for price, you've got a variety there. So I am going to change that. There we go. So that's how you change that setting.